up everyone, I'm Jackie Kim of Barney's New York and we are here at the Barney's Madison Avenue flagship store celebrating two days of the drop. Today and tomorrow we are having 30 exclusive collaborations come out as well as designer activations and PAs like the one we have today from the wonderful Mike and Mary. Thank you, thanks for having me. So, today's happening, like what's going on? Yeah, it's pretty amazing, it's, it's, it's so innovative um, with Barney's to have so many different designers at the same time kind of just uh, converge. It's, it's pretty massive. And I know today you have men's and women's pieces coming out. Mm -hmm. So do you have a favorite from the assortment? Um, my, uh, my personal favorite is our new boot. It's like a buckle boot yeah. with, um, with uh, bandanas kind of attached to it. We did a really special colorway for Barney's with uh, red. It turned out so good. So I'm really happy. Nice. And I also hear that at 12, when your collection comes out, you will be serving tequila sodas. Wow, this is news to me, so anything <laughs> Not you serving, but we will be serving. Oh, okay, great, <laughs> cool. Yeah, I still have my bartending in college. Um, yeah, tequila's my favorite. You were a bar bartender in college? You did whatever you have to do to make money. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. Which bar? It's college bars. <laughs> oh, I love it. Yeah. Um, so, also on this collection, you have a denim trucker jacket. Right. With palm trees and rhinestones on Right. It. Rhinestones for men. This is a new concept for me. Right. Tell it's me funny. But it. when I first started making clothes, like I, I only would do like certain pieces here and there. And since I was in LA, you'd get all these like singers that would pass through um, to do like events in Hollywood. And I would try to make jackets for them. And that's one of the first things I started with is like these amazing like rock and roll jackets and these stage pieces. Right. So I learned so much about like Swarovski crystals and how to set them and the correct way to set things on on paint certain fabric so now that um, I've kind of grown up a bit the collection's really big I look back to all those things that I did when I first started and um, get to like uh, relive them but this way they're uh, now not just like one piece for like a rock star they're sitting here above a beautiful marble floor of the right, I love it um, and tell me more about I guess this inspiration from LA does it still live in your collection is this still something that you find a big part of your design process yeah absolutely in the in the beginning it was really like a direct like what is LA fashion what is rock and roll what is Sunset Boulevard and then as you go season through season you have to even look deeper beyond like hey maybe it's not just a ripped jean like what tell, let's go further into this and it's great for me because I, I get this amazing sense of discovery of different ways to kind of tell that story and always stay true to that base but it's not as uh, it's not as direct as the first season so it's more and more fun every season. And the collection that's coming out today for women, I think it's a little bit more robust because there's like six pieces that, that are coming out. How do you envision your Amiri woman? It's funny. I always thought about that and it's like almost the counterpart of the man but not really aesthetically um, the same. So there's the same confidence, there's the same rock and roll attitude. Right. Um, but they have their own personality and they're, they're very independent. I always use this term like room stopper. Room it's a, stopper. Yeah, it's like a girl will walk in a room, they will just stop. And oh, it's she not, just like... It's not, it's not about her just wearing the, like, the craziest, most expensive things. It's just they have a quality that's really irreverent and strong. It's undeniable. I, ha I hope to like translate that into fashion. Do you have a, a muse or anything like that? Um, I've always had a few like growing up, you know, I have my crushes or like, you know, <laughs> you know Christy Turlington and Kate right. Moss. And, and oh yeah, Kate Moss, I could definitely see her. In yeah. Movie. I, I, I kind of try to stay true to that more than um, anything too modern. Well, thanks so much for stopping by. Thank you so much. And for those of you that are joining us live, we are dropping Mike and Mary's collection at 12 o'clock at Barney's New York at the Madison store on the third floor. So make sure you're here for that.